Oh my goodness. Is it that time? Oh my god. I've only got like 10 seconds left. Hello there, Ready Cat. How the devil are you? I was a bit loud then, wasn't I? Was I shouting? Hello. Oh my goodness. Your name is in dark blue on a black background. Enigma. Hello there, Enigma. Oh, we're live now, apparently. Oops. Um, so not prepared. Was busy doing something else. No, I wasn't. Here I am. Hello. You've caught me with a fish in my hand. Uh, just a bit loud. Oh, okay, sorry. Ooh. Actually, I just noticed my voice is going up into the little red zone. I'll calm down a bit. Oh, it's... Oh, it's like... Hello, guys. I'm just obviously overexcited. How the devil are you all? Where have you all been? I've been here ages. Look, nothing's changed. Well, it has actually. Look, I've got some more shel shulker boxes. Because these ones are... Ooh, look at that. I like this. I like doing this. Hello, Mr. Geeky. It's so nice to have you in stream. And you're in fluorescent green for me tonight. I always love the way it does this. Uh, uh, so Ready Cat says, I'm currently helping out my sister with her essay, so just be listening for a bit. That's no problem at all. Hello, Mr. Geeky. I am having a lovely time. Apparently I was a little bit loud and excitable when I dropped into string. Um, I'm here with all my chest monsters. And we were over here last time. Now, Ready Cat, you weren't here. As you will be the uh, queen of the sea... Um, if you have a look down here, uh, you'll see down there that um, I've actually like cut out this big area where we're going to bring the boat in, the big ship that's going to sit there, and that's going to be like plumped in there. We like cut all this out and we put some grass down the bottom, and uh, we stole some sea pickles from the ocean. And put them in here. And then I was told that you could actually uh, reproduce them. Is that the word you use? Is that how you talk about growing pickles? I don't know. But I wanted to do a few little jobs. I, I made this obelisk thing here. And um, hey, yeah, that's a good point, actually, uh, Enigma. So uh, it's very good that you're helping out your uh, sister. What's the essay about? Is the interesting question and also enigma are you knitting tonight see i remember i remember this stuff you see it was you knitting wasn't it i haven't got a completely wrong person because i spoke to halo and i said oh, i've got somebody in channel knitting listening to me what i'm doing and they said that's fantastic what are they knitting i said i don't know it could have been a hat scarf mittens uh, a woolly jumper all sorts of things um, yeah so I wanted to start down here tonight because I built this thing and never finished it and I think basically you were not the one knitting but you do so oh okay that's just made me a complete derp isn't it I got the completely wrong person um, so what was missing in here why didn't we we did this ages ago aha uh -huh. There is a severe lack of hoppers and wood. That may have been how we ended up down the rabbit hole. <laughs> Out here about 10 streams ago where we said, ah, oh, actually what I need is an iron farm and a load of wooden chests to finish this off. Um, so let's have a look. It's early childhood studies on how leadership and management methods and how to construct a good nursery environment. Ooh, interesting. I thought you were gonna say like early childhood studies as in like how children's brains work, because that I would find interesting. I know that sounds strange, but I would. I would find that very interesting. Um, so I'm gonna have a quick count up here, see how many hoppers, because we need two hoppers and two chests per row. That definitely sounds interesting stuff though. Uh, I might skip. I don't know what I'm going to do down here. I'm going to leave that for now. One, right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Sometimes my streams do get more exciting. 11, 12, 
13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. I wish I was 20 again. 21, 22, 23, 24. Actually, I wish I was 24 again, but let's not worry about that. 24. Right, so who's good at maths? Eek. That was a complete mess. Completely missed that jump, didn't I? Eek. Get out the way, block. It's me coming for it. 24 blocks uh, along. So we need a lot of wood. Hello, hello there, Jib Jib Ghibli. Is that, oh dear. Seriously, I understand why streamers now can't say stuff. Yeah, I've got cats. There are cats here. My coffee tastes weird. Ugh. What was that? There was something like brown in it. And I don't know what that is. Cat. Where did the cat go? Actually, I've got some raw fish down there somewhere. We need to get some more cats to skip because I've only got the one. Let, let me do that. Let me do that. Because I keep seeing the cats and I keep thinking to myself, I've got to sort that out. Oops. I completely missed the underwater door. Here, here is the secret underwater base no it's not underwater base I can't even get down the ladder hopeless raw cod uh, let's take half of them and I'm gonna put that one you can barely see the difference between them can you might have to do like a, an update change of that right we've got some I've got some raw cod don't really don't want them in there do I so when I find a fish a fish? A cat. Mon PJC's brain is completely fried tonight. I don't know what I'm talking about. And we're going to try and see if we can tame, tame the jelly cat. I know. I have not found the jelly cat yet. We have a mushroom cat. We're going to go see mushroom now. Because mushroom will have some stuff for us. So that is 48 hoppers. Aha, glad somebody was on that. Eight wooden planks per chest. That's a total of 348 planks or 96 locks. And you need 240 iron ingots. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Mr. Geeky, you are you're too much. Too much. Right. Let's see if I've got the um, said result. It's getting dark again already. <laughs> Have I got bed on me? No. It's a good job I've got an iron farm then, and a wood farm. Can I sleep? 96. Um, so 64 from night. So that's um, two stacks of logs and four stacks of iron. Sounds about right. Now I've got iron in iron blocks. Just nine, so I can probably get away with a stack of iron blocks. I think that's where I'm at. My maths is not that good. Right, so in here I've got these. Uh, so a stack of iron. So that's not that's equivalent to nine stacked here. That's twenty-seven. Oh look, I've got twenty-eight here. Look. I'm glad somebody's got the calculator out. Look at that. Perfect. Um, wood. Woody, woody, wood. Uh, I've got no logs. I just might as well just cut them off. When I started this, it seemed like a huge amount to actually go and collect. I'm just having a look to see if I've got any logs laying around in it. But um, now when you've got this, the monolith of locks. It's not really a scary thing to try and tackle. Uh, where's my super duper axe? There we go. You know what would be really useful is if I was re uh, ready for this sort of thing at the beginning of a stream. Please excuse me. Oh, really? Please don't try this at home, children. Because Mon can't cut logs, it would appear. I'm trying to get to the top and work my way down. And I've got two different types of logs now. 
just to confuse myself even more when doing this, should I actually work out how many there is in a row. Really useful pieces of information like that come in handy. Um, did I say one stack of logs? I did, didn't I? Now what? I'm just going to collect all of these. Because I like a bit of neatness and symmetry. So, Mr. Geeky, how have you been? How's the packing? Are you all packed and ready to go? Because Mr. Geeky is off on holiday soon. Look at that, I've got plenty of wood here. Excellent. So glad I built that tree farm. Saved me seconds of time. Anyone seen that cat? If anyone sees the cat, just type cat in chat. Because I'm bound to miss it again. Shh, noisy thing. Hello there, Citrus Rain. Nice to see you. I did see your message and I'm going to sort out the whole um, self-promotion channel later on. Right, 29 of these. Uh, that's one way to fill your inventory up. I really should have built all the chests first, shouldn't I, really? That would have been a good thing to do. Right, let's use a spare. I can reach that, I can reach that. So let's chuck my materials in. I already had 40, 46 of them in there. Oops. Yeah, I'm going to sort out the whole self-promotion for people. They can do things a bit easier. Right, lots and lots of chests is what we need. Some more of them. What's going on here? Don't be derpy, come on. 39. I thought you said we needed 48. Did I miscount? Have I gone completely wrong there? just got scammed on stream. Good, haven't started packing yet. That's a job for the morning. Oh, okay, okay. Um, oh, it's the geeky can tell you that. He, I, I, know, I know what he's up to. He's got a lovely bit of... I'm sure you said 48. Hang on, I forgot. Did I say there was 24? And... So I want 48 chests. I need more than that. Because that just gives me the hoppers. Then I need another lot of chests. I go get more wood. I think I'm miscalculating myself here as to what I actually need. Get another couple of rows of uh, logs. And I'll catch up with, ch try and catch chat at the same time. Uh, my string guard codes no longer work. Ooh. I'm not sure how that work would happen unless somebody gets your codes off you in stream. They can't do that because most of the tools block themselves from showing you the keys and stuff until uh, if you're online or if you're streaming but there are lots of dodgy people around to be honest uh, a couple of weeks ago well actually it was a few months ago when I was working over Christmas I uh, signed up to the company's loyalty card that I was with and just to get some discounts over the Christmas period and whilst I was like going through it on the website and that they said oh you, there's this pop-up that came up this thing come up and said oh you get 16 pound cash back on your next spend 
like, okay, let's have a look at that. And he wanted my email address. And I just like innocently put my email address in and went into it and stuff and had a look. Um, and created a free, what I thought was a free account. Lo and behold, I find out a couple of months later, he said, why haven't for the last two months been had um, money taken out of my account? I ended up paying for a subscription that I didn't know I wanted. I didn't know, well, didn't know I wanted, didn't know I had. More to be the point. But yeah, that, that was small print. Like, really? Uh, right, so let's put my logs in there. So let's go to some logs. I'm sure Sagiki is counting my logs and things now that I need. Uh, let's have a look. So, yep, so you're off to Argentina. Uh, it sounds like an amazing place to go. Oh, sorry, it didn't count the chest. Okay, so 400, 4, 425 logs. My calculations are correct. Wow. Wow. Well, just need two lots of 40. What was that noise? Oh, them two are not happy down there. Uh, just need to make a load more. So let's just crack through these. Oop, wrong chest. Right, so that should be enough of that. And I want 48 of them. So that will stop me from accidentally making too many hoppers. More iron. 38. Ten more to go, apparently. I think I've got this right. Ah, look at that. Perfect. Perfect. Uh, not stream. Oh, steam! Steam! Oh, I see. I see what you mean. Oh, and I need a few more chests because I'm a little bit short on chests there. Um, how many do I need? I need 14, which is 48 logs. Tonight's stream should be called 48. Why am I doing this the hard way? Everyone just look away for a moment. Where I should have just like divided this down and I've done it the easy way because I'm not really thinking what I'm doing. Can I? Why have I ended up with two, 10 too many? Oh well. <laughs> it's a good job Chris isn't here to be taking the mickey out of me. <laughs> right, let's go play some chests. Oh, the other thing I've got to do is got loads of earth, which I've got to rename into... Well, I'm actually not going to fill these chests up tonight. I just wanted to get these these in place so I can start getting the, the sorting system done. Because it's just been annoying me that I've got so many materials, like stone, and nowhere to keep them. I thought I really need to get in here and get on with this. And it'd be like the first thing I want to do tonight while I get going. See who's about. Oop! Fell off the end. Look at that. Perfect number. And 42 and a half. Where did we get half from? I'm confused. Uh. Ladder. How do I need get? I'm gonna need a, I need a liquor ladder. Oh, no, I can't get up that way, can I? Let's nick these ones. I'm gonna come back and finish the furnace array, auto furnace thing off at some other point. There we go. Thank you very much. Forty-eight and a half. Forty-two and a half. Forty-two. Oh, I was confused. Right, these ones need to go in this way, don't they? Right, see how many of these I can get right. Can I get all the way to the end? Oh, I'm getting scared. I felt my mouse was going off. 
splendid. Ho ho! Right, so, oop, it, oop, it, it, wrong keys, uh, crouch. And go back the other way. How much fun is this? Everyone's mesmerized on the screen. Please hit subscribe. We want to pay Mon PJC lots of money. There we go. Isn't that fantastic? Now that's how to make a sorting system. I'm sure I was telling people how to do this at the very early. Um. <laughs> as that? Oh, as? As? You're alive. I have not seen you for like ever. Yes, I'm on. I'm always about. Was about somewhere. How the devil are you? I'm trying to think, as when was the last time you were in chat? That was ages ago. Please say hello to everyone here. Um, I think you're already a follower, aren't you? We have some of my regulars. We have Chris. Oh, hello, Chris. You're there. And we have a Sir Geeky G Gamer in chat, the um, who is a much bigger celebrity than me, to be honest. And Rady Cat is hiding out there somewhere, who is well, will be known as the Queen of the Sea, because all of that out there is... Ah! What was that? All the sea is hers. Where's he gone? Poof, disappeared in a puff of smoke. There we go. Right, chest, things, what's this? Lots of earth. Right, now, need to make, oh my word, how many do I need? Four per hopper. So we had 24 hoppers. That's 48. That's 96, if I'm correct. Is that right? 60, 75. Mm. Do you know what? I'm going to do two stacks of it because that's probably going to be easier. Yep, as came into, you must be one of my right really early followers. I do remember, I can't remember what I was doing even last time I saw you. Right, so I always call this filler. I like the fact I can do all of them for one, one enchant, one point. That's really cool. So that's my special filler block. That's 96. Did I say 96? Did I get 96? Am I good at maths? So fun, funny thing. Well, not funny. So I, as many of you know, I'm out of work at the moment and my ongoing long stories of trying to find a job. And I've decided, right, wait for this, wait for this. I have decided, guys, that I am going to do one of my very long ambitions as a job that I wanted to do when I was a kid and left school. And that is to be a paramedic. In chat, it's either a long delay or no one reacted. Anyway, so I've been scanning around and looking. Ooh, yeah, thank you. Um, yeah, I've always been wanting to do it, and I I used to be in St John's ambulance as a kid and all sorts of things. What was I doing over it? Oh, I got all this filler stuff. So. What I'm going to do is, at the moment, they're advertising for apprentice emergency medical technicians. Basically, people that aren't paramedics that can sort of help out do that thing. I've got nothing in any of these. Ooh, where did that come from? It's not supposed to be in there. That's weird. All these are clear. Right. So I'm going to put my filler blocks down here so that we can come and sort all this out at a later date. No, I'm going to do it now. I'm going to do it now. There we go. I've decided. I'm going to do it now. 
So, yes. I'm going to... Give me that back. Thank you. I'm going to do that. So, as part of that, what I had to do was have a look on the website about signing up and everything. And they've just started advertising, as I say. And what I found was, is you have to have grade C or better English and maths. Right? Here comes the but. Mon PJC only has an F in English. Also, that's uh, what a selfish job to go into. Well, eh, I'd like to say that who wait what a paramedic yeah a paramedic and I don't goof up or anything um, so I only got an F in English <coughs> F in English um, as most people know I'm sort of slightly dyslexic although I don't let that hold me back from doing anything so I rang them up and I said is it going to be a problem and she went, yes. I went, oh, okay. That's what, even by virtue of the fact that I've got a ONC, a HNC in electronics design, I'm also a chartered engineer. I've, you know, my exam was like 30 plus years ago. Um, so she's agreed that she's going to look at my certificates that I've got for other things and have a look to see whether they're good enough to say, actually, Mon PJC can have a go at learning to be a paramedic. Well, an apprentice medical technician. Let's not bite off too much at once. I, I can do better than an F now. Apparently what you can do is you can go and do like a functional exam to actually sort of show that you're at that level. And it's basically just comprehension. You just got to read some articles and then answer some questions. And then you've also got to do some writing, some paragraphs. I don't know whether to just go for the exam straight off. Um, but they do say about punctuation and stuff like that. So I might have a look and see whether... I mean, not being funny, but how many paramedics do you see... <laughs> When they're writing out their form going and i must get my capital letters and my apostrophes in the right place otherwise the doctor won't be able to read my writing at the other end uh, no i don't think that's going to be a thing because i've seen most doctors write and you can't understand what the heck they've written anyway so and as for spelling words like uh cardiovascular and um, all them complicated words that they use, you know, it's it's not exactly stuff you're going to know off the top of your head to spell, is it? Uh, F means find another answer. <laughs> That's very true. Your dad's a dermatologist. See, I can read that word. I must be good enough. I'm sure. Anyway, I'll keep you all posted as to what happens that will make streams interesting because it'll be like streaming at all sorts of weird hours right so I've got that loaded up and we're going to be feeding in all our materials here like our iron and coal and all that sort of stuff so I need to start, start working all that sort of stuff out next but the next thing I want to do is I want to uh, I want to do a bit of sorting out how is the music guys is it too loud? Is it okay? I want to start working out the um, the bay here that we have. That's something then doing the functional exam. You would need to show that you can understand and reiterate what's been written or what you read. Yeah, exactly. So it's sort of reading it and then they like have a, like a multiple choice questions on the music's a bit loud. It's sort of multiple choice. So you sort of read an article and then it says, did the article tell you about A, B, C or D? And you've got to work out which one. One's blatantly wrong. The other one's a bit of a wild card and the other two are close and providing you've read it properly, you should be all right. 
So, I, other than that, I, I think should be good. I'm sort of excited. But my, my hunt for jobs has not been great in the past few months. So, what should we work on next? Because I want to work on like the the dock at the back here and the reinforced wall that's going to go round all of this. So I'm going to need, uh, let's have a bit of a tidy up. Um, because all this stuff in here is really not the right stuff. It shouldn't be, actually, this is all wood. Out of way, piggy. So these need to go in the wood box. And that's iron, so I'll just hang on to that somewhere. And that stone is in the right place. You love using this thing. It's fun. What the whole, um, like, capital letters thing. And the highlighted stuff. Why is it always dark? It's always dark. Let's drink the rest of my coffee. While we stare at a bed. And wait for night to fall. What was I just building? Um, so it's a, a mass storage area for this stuff. And there's going to be different stone, iron, all the different materials that would come in. And play it, well, me and other players can then get to those materials and access it. So we've got like a, a large community store. And the idea is that anything we've got left over, we can come over and dump off and it'll be stored. And the dock area here is supposed to represent how all the materials would be shipped to one area and there'd be lots of trading going on. So this is part of the idea of this area of the map is that there are farms and different things going on. So there's lots of materials and trading can go on in this area. Jobs are hard to find. I'm lucky. Uh, lucky I work for my dad. Well, that's cool. I worked with my dad. That was entertaining. No, it was all right actually. Um, right. Wall thing. Let me take some cobble and start looking at how I want to layer this out. Yeah. So I do like the whole medicine thing. I was silly enough when I left school to decide that that's got mending on it. I don't want to break that. Oh, I've not been to fix my tools since the last stream. Well, that's not good. Um, right, hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. Mon's got to engage his brain here. Eh, eh. So, how high up is this thing? Because that's the shape I want. And we've got to bring it down to that height. So we're one, two, three blocks too high. Hey, Chris. How you doing, buddy? Are you all right? Oop. Ah. Remember when I made five bucks on my first day on the server being released? Yesterday, me and the boys made 30. Wow. You guys are doing well. I am so jealous. You're obviously not going to need any help from someone like me then. <laughs> That's really good. Well done. It's good when you've got something like that and it's actually working for you. I mean, so many times people start off on projects and they just never quite do what you want them to. Right, that's one. Just need to knock this down. And you guys are going to get an idea of what I'm going for here in a minute. So I was looking at some pictures of docks and stuff like that. Suggestions, yes, money, no. Oh, thanks. You're not going to pay me. Um, I put three in there, didn't I? So on the fourth one there. So I'm going to build one of these and see what you think. Where's my steps? So I was looking at 
like dock areas and how they go about building various things. Oh, no, that's the wrong block, Mon. Uh, that one, that one, that one, that one. And then where's the slabby? The slabbies. The slabbies go in there, like that and that. And then when big, big blocks, big blocks for big boys, like so, like that. Knock that off the top, come down here. Actually, knock the whole thing out the way. That one like that. Aha. So yeah, I was looking at docks and have I still made that one too high? Ah, poop. Mm, well, that's going to have to stay like that because I actually want the arch to be seen above the water level. If I go down any further, it won't show. What the heck happened there? Um, it won't be seen. Right, so. As I was saying, oh dear, I'm about to let water in there. That's not going to be a good idea. I've been looking at how docks are constructed and made and laid out and I noticed that let's put that there like that that they tend to have like these big arches and things along the sides it's like reinforced walls and well mon's derpy music's on And they just look really good. So I thought, you know what, I'm going to have a go at making one myself. So I started making one there like that. And then I thought, yeah, right, let's go in for it. Let's go for it. Let's see what the peeps in chat think when this is built. You may decide it's naff, or you might not. Who knows? So it's going to, going to use a lot of materials, as you can see. And I need to clear this back wall out. I'll do that before I let the water in. Is that the bottom level? I think there's another one down there, aren't there? Yeah. Oh, this could be dangerous because this is all behind water down here. So how are you advertising then, Chris? Are you promoting through any particular channels or is it just word of mouth? Why have I not been invited? <laughs> special type of server? I think you said before that it was uh, like uh, normal survival or oh, I remember oh do I not have I do have those thank you there we go uh, right let's build this out just to give an impression of what you think right let's dive in the water and let's take the sand out oh, sand any green jokes no not green it's gout You would not understand what most things say. Oh, I see. Have you done it in your, your native tongue, so to speak? 
Well, that's pretty good, actually, because that's probably a good way of being, like, niche to your market. If you're targeting, um, I guess what you mean is you're targeting people from your own country. Because that's a good way to do stuff. Uh, right, let's put that in there. And... Water's annoying me right now. We'll put some other stone in there like that for now. And where's my water bucket? Any luck, this all fill in. Oh, what are you doing, gang? Come on. Where's the dodgy... Oh. Let's put some blocks in here to get rid of the... You're being derpy, game. Stop it. Right, where is it? Right, gone? Got it. So, what we get, it's going to need some imagination, I guess. Um, now, where was the coral? Ah, it's that. Not coral. The thingy what says. Them. And I'll put one back. There we go. It's ideally dark. Which is perfect for what I wanted to do. It's perfect timing, that is. Right, so let's go around here and I'll show you what this should look like with any luck. So the idea is, and I know I've done this all out of cobble at the moment, but the idea is these arches go all the way along the side there and the recess and a little bit of lighting in amongst the posts but this will be like stone broken bricks and everything but it'll be a dock side and the ship will be parked in alongside here and there'll just be a little bit of ambient lighting under the water coming up around the ship and these look like little caved areas and it's like a reinforced wall back there and then these arches are like showing where the pathway is all the way along the front. I like it. Thank you. That's awesome. Needs a little bit of imagination to start with these things. I look like Captain Hook with that thing in my hand right now. Wow. Do you believe in fairies? Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to lash it all out in concrete. In concrete? Stuck. Am I using my silk touch again? Oopsie. I shouldn't be doing that. Uh, let's use the proper axe, pickaxe. Right, so I'm going to lash it out in stone to start with. And then see what it looks like as we progress. So I've got plenty of stone. I've got that. I don't know if I've got this head. It's stone. Let's get rid of that and let's grab. I'm gonna use the come back and get the mossy and stuff later. And then we'll come back and we'll tinker around with how it looks. And obviously we've got to work on this area as to what this is gonna look like and how we sort out the terrain and what's even gonna get built here, etc. But yeah, so this idea here where we've got the small docks which is obviously far from finished but this is what I want to concentrate on next is getting this complete these areas and getting at least the shipyard ready for when somebody wants to come on and build the boats and get, start getting the buildings made so like, I want to like step it up a bit crack on with the game and uh, get it looking how I want it 
but yeah it's going to take a little bit of work now these I decided because that's an even number so I actually want these to be an odd number width and then we've got six I believe one two three four five six yeah so one two three four five six because it also means you don't end up with too many arches as well a little bit concerned I'm gonna like break through into the into that lot in there as well which you're gonna have to be careful with but if I build the wall first and then might have to do it from the inside or something I don't know there it goes One, two, three, four, five, six. There. When I did my last um, world, I did a lot of underwater building. And oh my goodness, it was a right pain. It's not much fun at all. I'm so glad I got this like aqua affinity thing on my helmet this time. One, two, three, four, five, six. And I will come in here and sort out the whole sand and levels underneath because that will be super annoying. I can't have brick on top of sand like that stone. It just, it just looks wrong. Even if you're under the water and you're like, oh, well, you can't see it down there. Well, no. Because it's only got to take one person to go under it, and it's like, it doesn't look right. I'm a bit of a stickler for getting stuff right. Just does my head in. Hello, iceberg! One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep, Mon is counting again. Counted all the way to 24 earlier. It's very exciting. I didn't think I was going to make it at one point. But, you know, everyone was there in chat for me. Even Sagiki got his calculator out and helped me. <laughs> uh, right, one, two, three, four, five, six. So this one's going to be interesting on the corner here. That's going to be the corner. Yeah, I think that'll be all right. Yeah, I'll just square off the dock here. And the ships will come in on that side over there. So, I hope Brady Cat's watching this. Are you still there? Are you keeping an eye on me? Using, iPhone, using your phone data. Oh, that's risky. Right, so we've got to do a similar thing round the corner here as well. So, this corner's probably going to be square. <laughs> Thanks, Chris. <laughs> You're there. I have no doubts. Make sure I'm doing my job properly. Right, is that... Oh, look at that. It's just slightly annoying that it's... Oh, I suppose we'll have to make it just that little bit short. And actually, I think... There would be quite good. I don't know how deep down those are supposed to go. I don't know whether to make them deeper. What do you think, guys? Should these be deeper and go right down into the water here? Because the idea I got from reading on the internet was that these areas were so that people could get space and access to the side of the ships for doing maintenance work on them so i don't want to go down really deep or just to leave it that high so i'm interested make the boats then sit well yeah that's true that's a good point I will follow your idea for now. The 
agree. Cool. I'm getting agreement. Things must be good. Um, <laughs> do, do you have this same sort of thing, uh, Sagiki? Of like a communal agreement on uh, what you're doing. I suppose it's a bit different with um, running a server. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Oop, there we go. But how do you guys decide what you're doing? All right, uh, that's an interesting question, I think. Mr. Kiki. You guys are all like trying to decide what's going to happen next on your server, what you will do. You have like communal meetings. Right, I've got to think here a bit because I want to go around the bend. One, two, three. And then I think we'll go four, five, six. Oh, this is a bit of a challenge for Mon now. Gonna like use all brain cells at once. Hey Silky! Where you been? You can't type. Um, I disagree. I can see things in chat and you appear to be typing. Unless you've just slammed your face into the keyboard and it's accidentally typed the words, Hey Mon, I can't type. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh no, I wanted a, a sixth gap there, don't I? Mm. So I think I will move that one over there. Have you just face palmed your keyboard? Is that it? Yeah, that's what happened. I, I guess that. It's amazing how you're continuing to do it. Just face palming the keyboard over and over again. It's still working. Maybe it's voice text. Ooh. Clever. <laughs> I didn't think of that. Right. That's one, two, three, four, five, six. I think that's the spacing because it's going to like come round a corner and it's going to look a bit weird. Wouldn't really have half things. Hmm. Do you know? We'll have a look, see how it looks. I think that's the thing. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, and then we're going to build a row in here. Your voice is nearly dead. How comes? What have you been doing? I saw that you were on stream earlier. Right, there we go. It's got that done. Um, it appears to be dark out here. Yes, it is. Let me swim if over here. It's funny because the first time I... Why am I going over here? That's not where my bed is. First time I read that, I thought you said, My voice is really dad. I missed the D. I thought, hello. Are you talking like a fella now? You sound like your dad. One, two, three, four, five, six. Thank goodness for that. It, it missed the secret portal. Talking too much? I can't possibly believe that you were talking too much. Is that? Oh look, as Mon's derpy music has started. <laughs> oh, can I knock that one out? There we go. Sounds like the IT crowd, yeah. Oh, I seem to be carrying too much stuff. Get another one in 
there. Let's go and get rid of this excess material that I'm carrying. I don't want to lose it. Dirt in there, sand bits over there, that's cool. Look how organised I am. I love this. All the shulk boxes. It's very exciting. It's worth, so worth it, that episode, going and getting them all. I'm proud of me, thank you. I feel fantastic now. Mon, can you recommend some British comedy for me? It's a British comedy. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hmm. Do you mean British comedy as in stuff that's just like in English or something? Or do you mean like British shows? Have you said the word classic? No, you've not said the word classic. Ooh, yeah, you see, that's where I was sort of going. You've got definitely 40 Towers. A Low A Low is brilliant. My funniest memory of A Low A Low was travelling to France and watching the French watch A Low A Low with French subtitles. Only Fools and Horses. Oh, Sagiki's here on the game here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, uh, only fools and horses. What about ever decreasing circles? Mr. Bean is uh, Halo's favourite. Rowan Atkins. So you've then got to say uh, Black Adder, and there's so many Black Adders to choose from there as well. Um, I think most people think. Uh, I liked Blackadder go forth the best. <laughs> Are you being served? <laughs> oh dear. Yes. I, I can hear Mrs. Slocum straight away with that most famous phrase. <laughs> um, yeah, 40 Towers is good. I, I was amazed there was only a very few number of 40 Towers. Um, hello! Outnumbered was very good, yes. That was quite good. Um, I'm trying to think of some... Three, four, five, six. You're making me count. I've got to count here and talk at the same time. It's very difficult. Um, what else was there? I was just thinking of. There are some ones like Red Dwarf. Now, Red Dwarf is like completely different style of um, TV pro. Most people think of sitcoms. Uh, of things like butterflies. Um, ever decreasing circles I've already said, haven't I? One, two, three, four. Or should I just make this the end here? No, I'm going to come out further and round a bit. One, two, three, four. Five, six. These may get adjusted once I actually start putting the stones in place. One, two, three, four, five, six. I think it's supposed to be that one. Oops. Yeah, like that. And that'll be the end bit here. That should give enough room for the ships to come into dock through there. I think they're good. Um, I've seen all the Monty. Oh, I've got The Life of Brian on DVD. I love that. Um, I don't think Halo particularly laughed that much watching it, but I just watched it and it's just like creases me up. If anyone's watched The Life of Brian, they'll know what I'm talking about with the stoning. I just sets me off every time with the giggles watching that um oh okay yes i'm building like a big dockyard or ships to come in here where's oh 
Oh, what was the show with Mrs. Bucket? Sorry, Enigma, that got... I don't know why that got shut. So, Mrs. Bucket was Mrs. Bouquet. Was her real name, wasn't it? And that... Oh, what was it called? Oh, please, somebody. Ah, uh, yeah, sorry, guys. You can't post links in here. Um, oh, it's because you put a dot between Mrs. and Dot Bucket. Yeah. Uh, always look on the bright side of life. Yeah. Yeah, from the life Brian. Oh, what was it called? Mrs. Bouquet. Oh, that's frustrating. It's really annoying when you know something, you just can't think of the name of it. Because it, like, bugs you for hours then. There was another one that used to be on that I can't remember the name of. And there was this woman in it. And keeping up appearances. That's it. And she used to be called Mrs. Wembley. And she was a really, she was a bit of an alcoholic. And everyone would say to her, oh, you have, are, you, are you having a drink there, Mrs. Wembley? And she'd go, just the one. Just the one. She, she was really funny as well. Uh, so there's a wall on this bit here. So that's level around here. Let's get this round the side. Oh, it goes off down here then, doesn't it? Uh, like that. I'm just going to follow, oh I shouldn't be like following the pack quite like that, I'm probably going to come back and dig it up. Okay, I should look up 40 Towers Blackagger and figure out where to, where to find Mr. Bean, not on Netflix. Really? I thought he was on Netflix actually. thought that was a thing. Where's my wall gone? see me walk. Um, but I think certainly stuff like Mr. Bean and that, they're the, the old classics. And then you've got to look for things like Monty Python. If you're looking for like what is British humour, I think that's probably where you're going to be looking. That's the sort of thing. And it's also the sort of thing that a lot of the time we refer to and people just don't really realise. I mean, it's like when anyone says, like, what's the answer to life? Or, oh, do you know what the answer is? And people go, 42. If you've not watched Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy, and the original BBC radio shows of that, or listen to them, people just don't know what you're talking about. They're just like completely lost. Uh, do, 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 do. Mon, you have 1,500, 260 honey cog points. You might want them. You might want them. Who knows? Rowan's fake James Bond on Netflix. And that wasn't actually too bad. You're confused what am I doing? I'm trying to build all these walls all the way around. So we've got the, like this massive dock area for the ships to come in. Uh, it should be on Netflix if you look under the British. You what you want it is TV gold. <laughs> now, there's a blast from the past. You have an MLP towel in my car from way back when I was first reading his... Oh, okay. Yeah, I wasn't quite sure what you meant then for a minute, but yeah. I can never remember. Are you supposed to like suck your thumb first and then stick your thumb in the air? And it wasn't it, wasn't it three pints of lager? I think. Can't remember. There are people in chat who have never watched this now thinking, what are they talking about? But this is the whole thing. It's just like, 
how it worked out. Right, I ain't going to do this in a boat, because bopping up and down in the water is going to do my head in. And probably everyone, mate, everyone who's watching will probably feel seasick watching me try to do this. So let's reverse my boat out. Um, I'm not done reading the extended trilogy through. Oh, okay. I'm not very good at reading. Um, not very fast reader, especially when it comes to books. So I actually prefer to sort of just listen to the stuff. And the original radio is all on like that. So I think that was probably my bet. That's the best option. Breaking news, Mumbo made a video about breaking Minecraft world records. It's not really a miracle with Mumbo, really. He's always making something. <laughs> right, um, I could probably build the rest of the... Actually, I should finish this side off first, I think. I think that'll be a thing. Build the wall all the way along here first. A not fast reader gang. <laughs> yeah, what sort of Minecraft world records are there? I think Mumbo's running out of material to make at the moment because he's been making some right obscure content ideas. I mean, I'm not knocking him for them, I've been watching them, but they're just not been what normally you know familiar with mumbo doing right let's have a look uh right what's the best way to build this thing put the uprights in first i guess I thought it might be easier doing it in a boat. I'm now beginning to wonder whether that's really true. And I've run out of cobble. Just got in the boat and I've run out of cobble already. Good job I've got a big box full of it. I'll be back to chat in a second. And let's see what's being said. Cobble, 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 cobble. Oh, is that it? Well, that's not very much cobble, is it? That's... Well, that'll be enough of what I want to do, I guess. Uh, Toy Cat did a video on how to make fake... Oh, I see. The boat makes me run out of cobble. Yep. It's a cobble sapping boat. Do you know it's a new feature? If I keep the boat pointed that way, I can probably dig from the side. Yeah, I can do it this way. Apparently digging is slower in a boat. Don't know why that's a thing. Probably looks really good from a third person point of view. Somebody was like watching me from a distance. <laughs> there we go. Look at that. Cobble farm. Yep, I've got a cobble farm. I just need to not smelt the, the stone. That's the key thing. Why do you have a golem head? Put it away. I know. I know. I really should tidy up. I'm like I'm messy and untidy, and I don't know what I'm doing. And I think I derped over here. Oh man! Because my post is supposed to be free white. Is that where? And I only left one in the middle there. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hang on. Let's think. 
I get, so I'm going to have a step, a block, a slab, a slab, a block, a step. So that will count as one. And the other one in there, I think. And then I'll put... I need to have one there, basically. So we have a step, a stone, a slab, a slab. Yeah, it's not going to quite match around there. I might have to, like, eke it out a little bit. Just, just to blend the shape a bit. Ooh, I'm caught in the turbulence. My head creeper mon. Ah, man. Mine call is really cool, dude. He eats underwater and doesn't afraid of standing on the wrong side of a bunch branch when chopping. That's true. Steve is superhuman. Actually, you can meet Steve in person in Sagiki's uh, Discord channel. Although he does come out with some, he's got some funny loyalties. That's all I'm gonna say. He's a bit of an odd character, is Steve. I did like the way he tried to dish you this morning, Sakiki. <laughs> oh, that was actually quite hilarious. That's probably the funniest thing I've seen him say. You can leap about 12 feet and mine 12 feet away from it. Yeah, exactly. What's wrong with that? What is wrong with any of that that you've just said? Steve is manic. I just love the way you came on to chat and said, Hi, how is everyone? And Steve goes, Oh, me, I'm fine. How are you? It's like, <laughs> go away. <laughs> Steve is a bot, by the way. For anyone who doesn't understand what we're talking about. Um, yeah, I'll finish that off in a bit. Right, let's go and have a look at my pattern again. Ooh, it's a big swing. Pick up the debris. Don't litter the sea, guys. Pick up your dirt and your rubbish. Don't leave stuff laying around in the ocean. Right, so step, stone, slab, slab. Step, stone, slab, slab. You want some steps, you want some slabs, and we do not have enough of any of it. So Mon needs to go and find Ooh, some cobble. So I could do that by turning off the cobble generator, I guess. Have we got any in here? Look at this stone, this nice stone that I've got, and I don't actually have any like proper cobble things. Look, let's get rid of the head. I did it. I'm just getting rid of junk out of my chest now. Oh, you gotta go now. No worries, the wave is up. Yeah, I know the feeling. When Halo gets home, I've got to get off the computer. Tells me off if I'm mucking around too much. You on that computer again? No, she's not like that at all. Ah, oh, look at all that. I've made into... Eh, and I could have had cobble instead. Right, do you know what, guys? Before I fire this thing up, I'm going to go for a quick break. So I'll be back in two seconds, guy.
That's that's the idea, guys. It's just supposed to be funny. Right. Uh, oh, blimey, it got dark while I wasn't looking. Crikey, was I going in the toilet that long? Must have been gone for hours. <laughs> Eek. Three. You lied, man. You always count me down. Normally I'm a bit more, like, savvy. And I know not to, like, say two sex when you're in chat. I normally know. I normally know better. Right. Uh, can I turn this thing... Is there an easy way to turn this thing off? Without breaking it. Choose carrot and thinks. Um, I could probably put like a a lever on the side there, and that would just lock the hopper, wouldn't it? Look at mushroom. Hello. Hello. Who's a cheeky little boy? Never mind. It. Oh, hang on a minute. You said two seconds. But you lie. But that poop took a long time. I would, I'm not going to talk about what I did, okay? Uh, never do that when I'm here. What, look at mushroom? Anyway, who would go for a poop in the middle of a stream? That's just not a thing. Right, is there any wood around here? Not in here. Let me make a lever. No, none in there. I'll, I'll just go and get a block of wood. Goodness. Oh, there must be some around the other side. What's, what's down here? We've got beds and chests and things everywhere. Uh, I need two bits of wood just so I can get one stick. Right, one of them. One of them, oh, one of them, thank you very much. Right, got lever. Could have used one of the other ones, but who cares. So is Halo taking or giving the toilet paper? Well, where did I post pictures about that? I know that does not sound weird at all. What's going on here? Why is that stuck? And that's fully grown. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. All the furnaces are full with uh, bamboo. That's what... What's that doing in there? Oh, I made that, didn't I? They obviously put that... Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, look at that. Wow. That's a lot of bamboo. Um, my cat just took over my chair. Can it hear... Mu can it hear mushroom? Is it responding? Up to find 94%. God, it seems to be taking forever. It does, doesn't it? it? does seem to be taking for absolute ever. Um, I'm going to put it there, and I think that will lock. Does that make that flash? No. I think... No, I don't think that works there, does it, like that? I think... Can I put it on the side... How can I lock this? Can I lock it? Could lock it there, couldn't I, basically? That, I believe, works. Yes. Okay, just before I turn the thing on, it doesn't. I look a complete doofus. Right, up we go. Now, does anyone... Re Why am I stuck? You know, uh, oh, okay. Can't get up that way. So anyone remember the last time I turned this on? There was a creeper in there. Remember? Right? Are we ready? Right, because I can switch this on and look in here and see what's in here. And I'm a little scared. Right. Nope. We seem to be all right this time. Oh, Jesus. 
machine still scares me. Oh, don't jump in the lava, Mon. There we go. Fire one. Fire two. Cool. I'm glad it's still working. No, don't remember I wasn't there. Oof. I'll have to get a picture of that. Because it looked really weird. There was just this, suddenly a creeper's face appeared in there. It's on the, on the stream. It proper spooks me out, it did. I was like, ah, creeper. Panic. What's going on here? Hello? Hello? Guys, we've got a leak. Could we? When when did this happen? Did that happen last time I was... I've got a stack of 64 already. Or did I already have that? Might have already had that. I'm just going to like... All of it. Oh, god blimey, even I took shockwave then. Struth! Scary working down here. Let's stand over here and watch from a safe distance. There we go. Yeah, it kept blowing a hole out the bottom, didn't it? Um... Should put a lid on the lava. Yeah, I should really. But I like the little spitty bits that are coming out of it. What I'm actually going to do is put a campfire over the top. And then we get smoke going out of it. And I don't know why I'm waving my hands because you can't see them. But I want to make the whole thing. I want to put stone brick. I want to find loads of clay and put brick around it. And make it look like a proper like industrial furnace thing. And then when these machines are running, I'll like make them drop smoke out or like pour smoke out the top so it looks all sort of pretty scary. Sound like something you should make a clip of. Yeah, I should really. I should sort my clips out. Loads of people have been doing clips. And I encourage you guys to do it because I'm gonna like put them all together and like put them out as a little video or something. Get a villager mason. Yeah, that's a good point. I've got to get loads of villagers all over there. Bricks get cheap. Oh, that's the point. I have more views than Dan. Oh, well, I mean, that just really depends on what people are up to and what they're watching at the time, to be honest. Different people watch different things. But it's very nice. I'm hoping one day I can, like, uh, pull in a decent crowd and actually entertain people. I like to do my best. Yeah, I need, a, I need a way of actually filtering off the cobble. That's something I was thinking of doing. Was having like two double chests of cobble. And then when they're full up... You see the blast go through. I'm sure I saw... Yeah, the blast is going through the bottom. Crikey. What's going on down here? We're actually in the blast zone down here. Oh yeah, look at that. Glitches through. Might have to make more of this out of obsidian. Oh, blimey. God, I even took a hit then. Um, so, yeah, I want to like, uh, maybe when I get a double chest, it like sets off a comparator and then... It's seriously dangerous down there. Oh! Um. <laughs> Poor little Mon's getting blasted down here, guys. Um, so yeah, I want to like build a double chest and then that way, when it's full, the excess then goes into being burnt into stone. And then, ooh. And then the stone, once it's actually been burnt in the furnaces, what I want that to do is to then automatically go and 
I don't know. I don't know where to do half and half stone and smooth stone. But I might do like a double chest of smooth stone. Ooh. Definitely taking hits there. But they're not actually doing enough damage. The rays of the blasts are reaching through. Might have to put more blocks down here or something. Or fill the whole thing with water down here so that takes more of the impacts away. It's pretty good though once this gets going. To be honest it's the first time I've made a mass farm like this. Most of the time when I've been playing I've been playing on my own and I've not been gearing up for running a server or having stuff of a server size that would be on the game. So uh, this is quite nice to do this way for once. Yeah, so the idea is that all this is going to be running and I get a lot of this working so that once people come on, that'll be good. You have one more viewer than Dexter1066, the owner of Dex Wolfpack, a community I'm part of. And that's why you're not why I'm not here much. Oh, okay. Okay. The cat's watching. That's good. I've obviously got a soothing cat voice. Right. How's the blast going? I've probably got enough stone down there now. What do you reckon? Oh! I even felt like my monitor jumped then. <laughs> right. Let's go switch the machine off. Yeah, we need some, like, better ways of turning this on and off as well. Silence falls. Right, is this still intact? It does appear to be at the moment. Right, how much did I get? Is that it? Two or three stacks. Oh, okay. Maybe I should leave this running then. Should we leave it running? Oh, bye silks. Right, I think I might actually leave this running while I go over there then. Let's do this thing. I can collect a load more cobble. I did actually think as well, if I get over to the um, the end and get some more shulker boxes, because I'm out now, and then that way I can... Um, let's actually put these in there for me. No, I don't need to, do I? No. Put them in there. Um, go over to the end and get some more shulker boxes and then get those machines to actually load up shulker boxes and then transport the shulker boxes around. And then maybe storage systems could like load and unload shulker boxes as well. That's getting a bit of advanced. That's a lot of materials. And a lot of messing around to get it done as well. Right, I need probably about half a stack of stairs and let's do half a stack of slabs that should be enough to keep me out of trouble for a little bit over there where's the sun it's over there cool and i need another way down into my boat so I'm going to build this all out of cobble to start with. Look at that. Did you see that? Somebody clipped that quick. I landed off there in my boat. Ha <laughs> ha How good was that? Chris, were you watching? Chris, where are you? Dude. I'm awesome. <laughs> It, uh, uh, can't drive me on boat. Ooh, uh. Did I just make that wrong? Uh oh. Nobody said a thing. Have I made that completely wrong? I, it's what? One, two, 
Three, four, five, six. Right. So what have I what have I done here then? I got this the wrong width. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, I wasn't watching, I was folding laundry. Oh, thanks. Oopsie. Mon made a goof. Look, it's too small. Oh, that's... Oh, man, that means I got them all out of place by one. Oh, for goodness sake. There's nobody in stream watching me. Guys. I'm supposed to be here to help me. You know, I mean, I know I let like you guys take the mickey out of me and all sorts of things, and then I like goof like that. <clears throat> it's alright, I don't blame you. Right. <laughs> Clip the boat jump. Yay! We need that. Right, so I've got to move all this over by one now. Oh, goodness sake. On you dork. That's normally the word I would use. Oh look, there's a little jiggly block. Come here. Right, I will sort this out and then I'll have to go under the water and sort the rest of it out after. Wait, 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 don't want that. Don't want that. Don't want that. Put that there like that. Zap the block. Right, are we back? Are we ready again now? Because they're all going to have to move along one. Which is really annoying. Because I was doing such a Good job, I thought. I was proud of myself and everything. I thought it like I did a, did a ting. Mon did a ting. I'm not actually sure doing this in a boat is any easier, to be honest. Oh. No. Doing this in a boat is... Not any easier. <laughs> <laughs> okay, reverse, place block, oh, block in, what, no, that block's in wrong place as well, I'll have that, can I have that one back please, thank you, I haven't got that many, did I get this all completely, why is it even further out, what's going on? Okay, let's go. What have I done? What have I done, guys? Look, that's what I want. I want a big loop, a big loop, and a big loop. <sighs> yep. Hello there, kitten. Hi, how the devil are you? Oh, I'm trying to, re I'm trying to remember people's names now. And where they've been and I'm going to apologize for everyone that I'm now bobbing up and down in water this is going to be like highly annoying well see you're doing pretty good I'm, this is really weird but are you Australian by any chance is that where I remember your name from I'm, I'm trying to remember who watches me I'm sure you've been here before certain of it to be honest no Seattle Seattle that was the one aha yes because I think you said you couldn't sleep or something was that right so my, my mind's starting to come back no do not do the Australian accent what are you talking about What's wrong with my Australian accent? I went on Meg's stream after that and asked her about it and she said it wasn't bad. She said there were a few words that weren't very Australian. Insomnia. Yeah. I remember I remembered something. See, I do listen to my, my people in stream and try and remember who they are and, and what they talk about. Like Chris's got a budgie. If anyone's interested, Chris, 
That's the budgie. And... Oh, now. Iceberg. Don't you have a cat? See, I'm trying to remember these things. I'm trying to be like professional. I think it's good for me to remember these things. Did I tell you guys about the fact I've got to go to the dentist soon and I'm going to forget everything about it? Because they're going to give me some weird super drug that makes you have short term memory loss. And it's scaring me a little bit. Yep, see, remember, you've got a cat. Mind you, you've been telling me that in stream tonight, haven't you? <laughs> so it wasn't exactly a big leap of uh, being out to remember anything, was it? <laughs> right, so I don't need that bit on the end there now. So we'll get rid of that bit over there. There we go, right. So let's just tidy this up. So, kitten, how are you? How is the sleeping? Are you still having trouble? I assume it's a long-term thing from what you were saying. And how is Seattle? Is Seattle sunny? Where are you getting done at the... Oh, what am I getting done at the dentist? Right, so... I... Hmm... Okay, how do I explain this? It's nice today. Hmm. It's not been too bad here. We've had a bit of rain. Not as much as normal for the UK. But yeah, it's been alright. So, um, quite some time ago, when I was a, a little mon PJC, I experienced a situation where it wasn't very nice and I had a sock pushed into my mouth and was basically being bullied at the time and I sort of like gagged quite a bit on it and ever since then I've had this like really strong gag reflex when I go to the dentist and stuff because I don't like the fact that other people are putting things in my mouth and I don't have control of the situation so when I go to the, I've derped all of them, haven't I? Is there seven or something? How have I messed up? I oh. Stay calm, Mon, stay calm. You join Mon at a time where he's completely goofed. Yeah, so I didn't have a great time. And every time someone's putting something in my mouth, it's well pretty horrendous experience for me so most 99% of the time to be honest I go to the dentist not really much of an issue um, I work through it I do all right but I have to have two fillings done which are at the back of my or well, they're my my back two teeth on the left and right on the lower side on the lower half and of course round by the back of your tongue is where I gag the most or I suffer the most with gagging so hence I am going to a specialist dentist to have an injection where apparently I won't care about all this happening to me so I'm not going to be put out, but this drug apparently just makes you just not care about what's happening to you. It's been an entertaining experience, I guess. How should I do this bit? I'm a bit confused. I might do it around that way. Um, yeah, so following the treatment, apparently this drug makes you have short-term memory loss which is pretty disappointing because it's on um, to the 25th and anyone who knows knows that Shrove Tuesday which means I will, I will be having pancakes now it's not the laughing gas 
Now the laughing gas just knocks you out. I've had that before. Now this is a, an, an intravenous drug that's injected into your bloodstream. The I don't care shot is nice. Oh, okay. Well, I probably... I don't know if you've actually had that. But apparently I'm going to suffer short-term memory loss. I might be able to remember anything about most of the day. So it's, it's going to be an interesting experience. Guess? Not really sure what's going to happen. Laughing gas doesn't knock you out. Sort of true. It tends to keep you out. That's the that's the way it works. So I need to put that one there. God, this is right messy. I'm gonna spend ages tidying this up. Put them there like that, and then them two to have slaps. Slaps, 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 slaps. slaps. Uh, shots in your back. Wow. My mum's fear of having things rubbed off on me when I was small. I heard her talk about things. The dentist was one of them. It used to be as classical music to focus on. Yeah, unfortunately, mine doesn't quite work like that. It, I got a couple of teeth at the front, which are a little bit crooked, and um, they tried to even use the gas to get an impression of my teeth when I was a kid to try and help me straighten them out, and they gave up. Because <laughs> even with the gas, I was still having problems. A little bit of an awkward child, I guess. But we all go through, we all have experiences of things like this, I guess. Different people have. What's, what's going on? I think this wall's all gone completely peaked on. Let's go and get my boat. Can't see what's going on. Because why has my wall got lower? Well, it has got lower, hasn't it? What did I do here? Oh, the step there. Ah, oh, ha, 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 ha. That should be there like that. Oh, oh. That's interesting. It's, uh, my brain's just glitched inside a block. It's, it's trying to swim out of the current. Oh man, the seaweed mouth mold is horrible. Oh yeah, I don't know how people do that. Seriously, do not know how people can even just the idea of it. Just like, uh, no, nope, I'm not going. <laughs> not happening. <laughs> well, put it this way, it's that bad they can't even get X-rays of the back of my teeth. I've not had one of those. You know how they put like the little bit of x-ray on like a plastic thing and they put it in the back of your mouth? It's a God's truth. These currents are strong. Oh, that one doesn't like doing that. Right, okay. Let's do that. Concentrating. Concentrating. Oh, turn out. Why have I now got a water current in the middle of the lake river here? How's that thing? Oh, derpy water. Stop it. I'm now stuck in a mysterious eddy current. I can't reverse my boat out. Ooh, into some. I'll have to sort that out with some sand or something. Uh, there's an x-ray. Go swim into the underside of a block. And the funny thing is, if I put dentist tools in my mouth myself, I'm pretty much all right. I can, I can put most things in the back of my mouth. I can clean my teeth, no problem. I don't have that as, a, as an issue. 
it is just literally a whole thing with um, somebody else taking over. Oh, blimey, that's got a bit of a current there, isn't it? Uh, where is it? Is it this one? Nope. That one? Nope. Around here somewhere. Where are you? Gotcha. Aha. I found you. The elusive invisible block of water. It wasn't a block of water. There was an absence of water in the water water. Something like that. Yeah, I can't get the X-ray tool thing in my mouth. I've, I've, they won't. They keep telling me, "Oh no, you're not allowed to do that yourself." I did sort of have a bit of a go, but didn't really work. I don't think it helps that I was like thinking about it. So, yeah, didn't work. I tried. Can I get that one in there? Eep. There we go. Blend it. <laughs> Find a dentist that lets you. I don't think they're allowed to. I think that's like part of their like law or something. Or safety rules or things like that. I mean my hygienist, I mean she only lets me um, hold the pipe, you know, the suction pipe. And that way that makes things a lot easier for me because I don't have to panic about that so much. You have to work out how to build this door into one of the things. Build the arch over it or something. Hmm. Interesting. Anyway, guys. Um as the sun sets behind me, oop, and I got my barrier in my face, I'm afraid I'm gonna to have to say it's time for me to go. Because well, it just is. It's 20 past nine and I've had a long day and Halo will be home in the next five, 10 minutes. And I want to have my dessert because she has dessert when she gets back from yoga. And I don't want to miss dessert. Dessert's awesome. So thanks very much everyone for watching. It's been really nice to have so many of you in there. Thanks Kitten for coming by. Enigma, uh, Citrus Rain, Iceberg, Rady Cat, I know you're out there somewhere. Jilly B, you guys are fantastic. Thank you very much for coming along. Uh, next official stream will be on Monday night at seven o'clock UK time. There might be another one. Oh, a raid. Should we have a raid? Okay, right, let's lock the screen. Let's go for a raid. Where, where are we? Come on in. Uh, where's my stream program? There it is. I've lost everyone out of chat now. Oh my goodness, it's gone really slow. Where have you gone? Come on. Who are we going to raid? Right, somebody said Dan. Let's go raid Dan. Dan is playing The Walking Dead. Um, he's playing this with a VR headset on. So he's normally really funny. Um, I will warn anyone, anyone with a sensitive disposition to swearing, screaming like a girl at anything frightening, please go now. <laughs> because Dan normally panics like anything. Anyway, have a fun time, everyone. See you all later. Bye. Doing. We've got another raid, Mum PJC, double raid.